All right, look, man. Forget the fact that Lil Tim shouldn't probably do this song because he's fighting the case that they could possibly use music in the court of law. Multiple rappers are getting their lyrics used against them. Forget all that, right? Matter of fact, even forget that he's even fighting that case. Because whether he was still on the case or not, and they awarded him self-defense right now. Forget all that. But is anybody in Lil' Tim Kent, 4KT, NBA, whatever three-letter words it need to be, is there anybody who going to be real and tell Lil' Tim, Bro, you did not intentionally mean to kill King Von. Do not come out with no song dissing this man. Yeah, he died from the result of you shooting him. And yes, you are a shooter because obviously you shot. But why in the hell is this nigga coming out with a song this is King Von? Acting like for real, for real. Man. Bro. I don't care what nobody talking about, bro. That's goofy as hell, man. Like Lil' Tim, man. Look at yourself in the mirror. Look deep in your soul. You didn't mean to kill King Von. So unless you gonna get on this song, which we all heard snippets of it, Unless you about to get on this song and say, I ain't mean to kill him, but I hit him a couple times and he died anyway. Then it ain't real, bro. Ain't nothing you saying real, bro. And that's just being real, though. Like, R.I.P. Vaughn, shout out Lil' Tone, because I don't got no size in it. No rap, no gang, no nothing, man. I'm 30 years old. Nigga, the hell I look like picking somebody. But, while well, I sit here high out my mind, why is there nobody telling this man? Just goofy, man. That's just my opinion on it, man. You feel what I'm saying? Like, Lil' Tim, I wish you the best. If you want to rap, go ahead and rap, bro. But uh, if you going to do it, man, at least do it real, bro. At least tell the story how it's really told, man. Come on, man. Even though you had, you ain't had beef with Vine like that. You know, even Quando Rondo ain't had beef with Vine like that. You ain't, y'all ain't know Vine was going to swing and, and damn near fucking beat Quando Rondo half to death in .3 seconds. Y'all ain't know that. It was a cause and react situation. It was also self-defense, and there also was no kill shots, man. Like, we gonna keep it real. So that's Lil' Tone, how I feel about that song. While y'all keep asking me, how do I feel about Lil' Tone coming out with a diss song? And, uh, NBA Youngboy. So, uh, a lot of people, uh, been telling me, uh, NBA Youngboy might get out. NBA Youngboy might get out. From this lawyer. Man, who the hell is that dude, man? Who is that dude that just always be breaking down these cases? Who is this man? Like, is he even a real lawyer? What is it? Who is this dude who talk real fast? So the court. So regardless of who he is, I don't know who the hell this dude is. I don't even know if the dude know what the hell he talking about. But since so many people keep coming at me about what this dude said, the NBA young boy might get out, NBA young boy might get out, talk about NBA young boy getting out. NBA young boy, if you do get out and they do give you a bond and drop the charges or whatever going on, 
you are more needed on these streets. Not even on these streets. You are more needed out of jail, but I got a different twist to it. Because a lot of people keep coming at me talking about, bro, NBA Youngboy need to be free. Look what happened to Baby Joe. NBA Youngboy need to be free. Ever since he went to jail, his niggas, they just keep taking L after L. Fuck all that. NBA young boy need to be free for all them goddamn kids he got. And that's as real as I can be. The hell with all that extra shit. Cause that shit could take him away from his kids. See, you in jail, nigga. You can at least talk to him, get visits. If you dead, nigga, because you in a war that don't seem like it's stopping, well, your kids ain't got no goddamn daddy. So... I only want you free, not to help Baby Joe, not to help 4KT, NBA, Quan Boy, none of that. But to help them goddamn kids, man. And make sure you the best father you can be. Now, I ain't the perfectest father, but I'm a trying father. And that's the best thing that niggas from the streets can possibly do. So with that, uh, shout out to NBA Youngboy. I hope you get out, man. King AK47, voice of the streets, man. Everybody hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel if you ain't subscribed, and share this video, man. I'll see y'all in a minute. Shout out to the gang. Shout out to everybody who been donating. Shout out to everybody who been viewing, hitting that like button, subscribing, everything. I appreciate all y'all, man. I'll see y'all in a minute. Make sure y'all hit that like button before y'all leave.